Good morning, it's Tuesday, October 26th, and I'm Tamara Smith, and here are the stories we have for you today. Senior Dinner Dance guest forums are available. And a Flapjack fundraiser coming up. Good morning, I'm Shanika Bell. The JHS Report is coming up next. Open mic tryouts will be held November 9th in the cafeteria right after school. If you can sing, dance, or have any JHS Boys Soccer Team invites you to participate in Applebee's Flapjack Fundraiser Breakfast to support the Boys Soccer Team. This event is being held November the 6th from 8 a.m. to 10 p.m. at the Applebee's in Clarksville in front of the Green Tree Mall. Tickets can be purchased through a soccer player or see Miss Strait. Any girl wanting to play in the Powder Puff football game needs to pick up a packet in Mrs. Rector's room, B113, before school or after school. Packets are due Tuesday, October 26th. Senior dinner dance guest forms can be picked up in Ms. Rector's room or in Ms. Nellie's room before school or after school. All guest forms are due November the 5th, and all guest forms must be approved before you can purchase a ticket for your guest. The JHS Report is happy to air your announcement. Simply fill out a form located in the front office or have a staff member email Mr. Gross, and we will do our best to make sure that announcement gets on the air. There will be a step team tryout tonight from 6 to 8 p.m. and again Thursday and Friday from 3 to 5.30 p.m. Please meet in the Commons area, bring a physical form, and wear comfortable clothing. Any senior wanting to attend Sullivan College of Technology Design should see Mr. Churchman no later than Wednesday, October the 27th. We will have the JHS Weather Forecast plus your latest Jeff High Sports after the break. Hungry? Why not try Moby Dick Seafood? 700 East 10th Street in Jeffersonville. Voted best seafood in Clark County. Feed two or more with a box of two or more for only $14.69. Seven days a week, dine in, carry out or drive through. A clean, comfortable restaurant for the entire family. Open till 9 p.m. Monday through Thursday, 10 p.m. Friday and Saturday, and 8 p.m. on Sunday. Stop in and have a whale of a sandwich. Good morning, I'm LB Gary. Today is JHS Weather for What's that? Okay, just in, a wind advisory remains in effect from 8 a.m. this morning to 8 p.m. this evening. A wind advisory means that sustained winds of 30 to 39 miles per hour or wind gusts from 40 to 57 miles per hour are expected. Tonight, some clouds early will give way generally clear conditions overnight with a low of 49. And tomorrow, sunny and windy around 75. That's a look at your JHS weather forecast. Now here's a look at JHS Sports with Josh Zinzer. Good morning, I'm Joshua Zinzer with the latest Jeff High Sports. Jeffersonville boys soccer season came to an end Saturday in the semifinals of the Evansville semi-state, but Jeff finished the season with an 18-3 mark and earned its third regional title in school history. Team records set this season are tied the previous record for fewest team goals allowed with 19, set new record for single season wins with 18, tied the best conference finish in HHC second place, set record for most team goals scored in the season with 95, actually led the state in scoring. Second place team scored 92. Old JHS record was 64 last year. Team won its fifth sectional title and third regional title. Individual records set were most assists in a season 20 by Lucas Rigsby. Old record was 14 by Danny Carlillo in 2006. Most goals in a season 22 by Brian Fisher. Old record was 20 by Ben Bauer in 2006. Most points in a season, 51 by Brian Fisher, old record by Ben Bauer in 2006 at 43. Jordan Behar finished with 50. That's the latest Jeff High Sports. Stay tuned. A final word from the news desk is next. Finally today, it's a great way to wish your classmate or a special friend a happy birthday. It's easy to do with the JHS Report. Birthday greeting. Bring six pictures and $5 from 713 at least a day in advance, and we will get your birthday greeting on the air. That's your latest Jeff High News. We hope you have a great day. I'm Shanika Bell. And I'm Tamara Smith. Join us tomorrow for the latest news and information. And thank you for watching the JHS Report.
Here you go, LB. I'll do my best with that screw. <laughs> Alright. Alright, let's go. Ready? Whenever? Alright. Good morning, I'm LB Gary. Today is JHS Weather for. What's that? Okay, just in a win of. Wins this strong can bake. Oh, shit. Alright, I got it again. Alright, here we go. All the way. Got it. A wind, of, uh, a wind advisory remains in effect from 8 a.m. this morning to 8 p.m. this evening. A wind advisory means that sustained winds of 30 to 39 miles per hour or wind gusts from 40 to 57 miles per hour are expected. Winds this strong can make driving difficult. Today, we also have a high of 73. God, I suck at this. There's too much to read and too much to say. A wind advisory remains in effect from 8 a.m. this morning to 8 p.m. this evening. A wind advisory means that sustained winds of 30 to 30 miles. You're making me nervous, Mr. Gross. You're out here. Uh, the teacher making me nervous. Uh, All right. Be nervous about. Here we go. I'm enjoying the breeze, man. Yeah. 